ハローこんにちはイッツセッション How are you doing today? Last time we learned how to count objects by using こつほんぽんぼん Today we learned other counting methods like にんまい Are you ready? Let's get started! First, let's learn にんにん can be used to count the number of people. Please take a look at it. After three people, we use にん But we call one person ひとり Two people ふたり Then さんにんよにんごにんろくにん7人8人9人10人 Next is まい。まい can be used to count the objects that are thin and flat. For example, paper, plates, and shirts. Let's practice it. One, いちまい。Two, ni ma i. Three, sa ma i. Four, yo ma i. Five, go ma i. Six, lo ku ma i. Seven, na na ma i. Eight, ha chi ma i. Nine, kyu u ma i. Ten, ju u ma i. In previous and today's lesson, I introduced. こ、つ、ほん、ぽん、ぼん、にん、まい。Besides them, we still have a lot of different counting methods, such as だい、ひき、はい。I will show you how to use these counting methods. Each time we see them in my lesson videos. Great job! Today's homework is please review the counting methods we learned today. In the homework review video, I will test if you can count using them. Please check it out! In addition to that, I made a lot of Sushan original learning materials! Such as an original vocabulary list and a private homework checking on my Patreon page. If you are interested, please check the description section below. There is a link to my Patreon page. Please get Sushi-chan original learning goods. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do so by clicking the subscribe button. That way, you won't miss any future lessons. See you soon! Bye bye!